coming to you from Europe, where Orbiter Travel is taking you to our top 10 choices for the best places to visit in this picturesque and historic continent. Make sure to stick around to the end as we'll share with you a bonus destination that is a must-see on any trip to Europe. One of Scotland's most beautiful and exciting destinations is the capital city of Edinburgh. Well known for its vast assortment of amazingly preserved historic buildings and castles, the majestic 13th century Edinburgh Castle is one of the most popular and visited castles in the entire United Kingdom. Other highlights include the Royal Palace, home to the Scottish Crown Jewels, the Scottish National War Museum, and the Stone of Destiny, which finally made its way home after being held in London for over 700 years. Edinburgh's Royal Mile District is a must-see with its glorious architecture, countless restaurants, cafes, shops, and impressive art galleries. Formerly known as Constantinople, named after the Roman Emperor Constantine the Great, Istanbul is the tourist center of Turkey as well as its largest city. Known for its culture and historical significance, Istanbul has a population of over 15 million people, making it the largest city in all of Europe and the 15th largest city in the world. In 2010 the city was named the European Capital of Culture, and upward of 17 million people visit Istanbul every year, and the city's history is long and storied as it was an integral part of the Roman and Ottoman empires. Istanbul's amazing historical architecture will leave a lasting memory on you. Established in the 12th century as the principal settlement in Ireland, Dublin is the largest city in the country with a population of just over 1 million people, and in large part because of its unique history, architecture, beautiful green scenery and wonderful food, Dublin has long been a favorite with tourists. Whatever your fancy, be it castles, parks, or just hopping from pub to pub for a few pints, Dublin offers a little of everything for everyone. And no trip to Dublin would be complete without a visit to Dublin Castle, which was built in the year 1204, primarily as a defensive fort, though it was eventually transformed into the primary residence for the Viceroy of Ireland. Budapest, also known as the Little Paris of Middle Europe, is the largest city in Hungary, with a population approaching 5 million people for the city itself and immediate surrounding areas. Budapest is a very popular tourist destination, not just with people from the middle of Europe but from all over the world. Over 12 million international tourists visit Budapest annually, making it one of the most popular destinations on the planet. This beautiful city has a rich culture, and its historical significance runs deep, including a 150-year reign under the Ottoman Empire in the 16th and 17th centuries. Budapest is teeming with wonderful natural parks, stunning synagogues, churches, and museums, and its numerous geothermal baths are favorites of both the locals and tourists. The source for these popular baths are upwards of 80 geothermal springs, which comprise the largest thermal water cave system of its type anywhere. Universally regarded as one of the most beautiful cities in the world, the city of Prague offers a wide variety of attractions for all ages and is one of the most popular tourist destinations in all of Europe. The capital of the Czech Republic, formerly known as Czechoslovakia, Prague is a major economic and cultural hub in Central Europe and also the country's largest city with a population approaching 1.5 million people. Among Prague's many cultural attractions that survived the devastation of war-torn Europe in the 20th century are the Old Town Square, the Prague Castle, Charles Bridge and the oldest working clock in the world, the Prague Astronomical Clock which dates back to the year 1410. Known the world over as one of the primary centers for the high fashion industry, Milan Italy has an abundance of culture, art and exquisite dining opportunities, making it a true hotspot for tourists. Located in northern Italy, the Greater Milan area, which is so large that some of it extends into Switzerland, has a population approaching 12 million people, making it the largest city in Italy. The capital of the Western Roman Empire between the 12th and 16th centuries, Today Milan is the third wealthiest city in the European Union, just behind Paris and Madrid. Cultural attractions include numerous theatres, museums, and beautiful historical landmarks, and the food available in Milan is so exquisite the famed Michelin Guide provides the city's cuisine a very high accreditation. If you are enjoying this video and love to travel, be sure to subscribe to the Orbiter Travel channel, and be sure to hit the notification bell to be alerted when new videos are released.
Described by Hans Christian Andersen as the Paris of Spain, coming in at number 4 on our list is the beautiful city of Barcelona, the second largest city in Spain. And this wonderful city has an abundance of just about everything for tourists of any stripe, markets, museums, beautiful churches, some of which are very gothic, even haunting in appearance. And the shopping opportunities in Barcelona will keep you, and your credit card, quite busy for many hours. Back in the Middle Ages Barcelona was founded as part of the Roman Empire. And this historical heritage is evident in the breathtaking architecture and scenery of this jewel of Spain. Among these must-sees is the mesmerizing Basilica de la Sagrada Familia, the largest unfinished Catholic church in the world. It's truly a wonder. Coming in at number three on our list is London, the capital of both England and the United Kingdom. And with a population of 9 million people, it is also the country's largest city. Among London's most popular tourist attractions are the Tower of London, home of the Crown Jewels, the amazing London Eye, one of the largest Ferris wheels in the entire world, Buckingham Palace, the official residence of the royal family, and the National Gallery, located in London's Trafalgar Square. Other must-see attractions in London are the beautiful Hyde Park, which in many aspects is similar to New York City's Central Park, the Great Clock Tower Big Ben, located at the north end of Westminster Palace, and Piccadilly Circus, instantly recognizable with its bright neon signs and high-definition screens. Historically the capital of the Roman Kingdom and the Roman Empire, Rome is the modern-day capital of Italy. Located on the central western portion of the Italian peninsula, Rome is unique in many ways, including having a completely independent country located inside the city confines, Vatican City, which is under the jurisdiction of the Pope. By population, Rome is Italy's third largest city with nearly 3 million residents. Known to many as the Eternal City, Rome is considered by many the cradle of Western civilization, as well as being the center of the Catholic Church. And its storied history spans a staggering 28 centuries. Among Rome's countless historical attractions are the breathtaking ruins of the Colosseum, which dates back to the Roman Empire and to this day remains the largest standing amphitheater on earth. And coming in at number one on our list of the top 10 places to visit in Europe is the beautiful city of Paris, France, which in the 19th century gained its long-standing nickname, the City of Light, because of its groundbreaking early system of lighting the streets. Paris is the largest city in France with a population of well over 2 million people, though the overall Paris region has nearly 13 million residents. The cultural offerings of this beautiful city rank among the very highest in the world, which explains why it is one of the most popular tourist destinations on the planet. Among its most recognizable attractions is the Eiffel Tower. And no trip to Paris would be complete without visiting the amazing Louvre Museum, which attracts 3 million visitors annually. Earlier in the video I promised you a bonus European destination that is a must-see if you're really looking to have fun. And it's nearly impossible not to have fun in Amsterdam, the capital city of the Netherlands. From parks, spectacular museums, and a bustling nightlife that rivals any city in the world, Amsterdam has everything a tourist would want in a European city. Among Amsterdam's most popular attractions are its historic river canals and the Van Gogh Museum, which houses some of the most prominent art of the country's most famous artist, the great Vincent van Gogh. And of course if you're looking to really spice things up a bit, Amsterdam is renowned, or maybe a bit notorious, for its plethora of adults-only activities, including its many cannabis cafes and infamous red light district. Whatever floats your boat, Amsterdam provides it in abundance. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great travel videos and be sure to subscribe to the Orbiter Travel Channel and ring the bell to be notified of our latest videos.